ladies welcome back to another video how are you all doing hope you all are doing great as always i want to thank Almighty god for another bright and beautiful day over here i have my one white onion you can use the purple one or you can use the yellow one this onion has a lot of sulfur that is great in promoting healthy air growth in today's video i'll be sharing with you how i miss onion and ginger to make an effective powerful air growth shampoo to grow my hair from alopecia badness sherry postpartum sherry to moisturize my hair stimulate blood flow into my hair thicken stackings my hair conditions my hair and I will promote healthy hair growth faster if you are having alopecia shedding breakage if your hair is not growing your hair is always thin your hair is always dry and brittle i urge you all guys try this recipe you are going to love it i have so many amazing recipes when it comes to onion and ginger yes because it's working yes because i love it on my hair and i have so many amazing feedback whatever my my friends my my audience they, they use it and they love it as well so right now i'm just cutting my ginger into a dice form for easy blending i added one amazing ingredient into this shampoo that's why I, I urge you all to try and watch this video so towards the end to see the amazing ingredient i added for inside so over here i have my acv my apple cider vinegar you can use use any one of your choice i will go in with 20 ml of my acv guys acv means with onion and ginger is amazing when it comes to cleansing our scalp treating our scalp stop your hair from breakage for inchiness conditions this scalp you're having any dandruff scalp irritation just try apply this amazing treatment you are going to love it so after I had my 50 ml of my regular water, I'm going to blend into a smooth consistency. I urge you all try blending this uh, recipe into a smooth paste to bring out all the nutrients. At the same time, I want to thank you all my friends, my family. I want to say thank you all for your sweet love and support. Your girl is so grateful. God bless you one after the other. And if you are new here, welcome. My name is Jenny. I'm into air growth tips like this one you are watching right now if you find the video useful or glance through my page if you love what you see then give me a far too just up share to friends and family leave me a comment down below is free of charge so right now i will go in with this my cheese cloth i'm going to strain out the juice away from the pop i urge you all try this process it's extremely important and you can use your filter or you can use your stock anything at all you are good to go so right now i'm going to press out as many juice as i can grab my hands on as you can see me doing So lovelies, after I strain, here is the amount of the juice I got. So I will go in with my casting soap. You all know I love casting soap a lot. But you can either use your regular shampoo or you can use your black African soap. Mix it with this uh, juice. So I'm going to pour in my casting soap into my onion and my ginger juice then right now i will go in with my black castor soap i will use the mango and the lime jamaica black castor uh, castor oil sorry guys castor oil so i will go in with one teaspoon of my castor oil then over here i have my avocado oil i will go in with one teaspoon as well of my avocado oil guys when it comes to the oil any one of your choice just apply you are good to go then right now i will go in with my essentia oil starting with my tea tree essentia oil i'm going to add 10 drops of my tea tree essentia oil then over here i have my lavender essentia oil i'm going to apply 10 drops as well so after i added all my essentia oil into it i'm going to mix everything together like so
so guys to give this shampoo an amazing sleep i will go in with my sada gum guys sada gum into your shampoo is amazing it will help you detangle your hair really really well and give your hair that moisture that you need but i urge you all before you add your sada gum into your mixture you have to do this process any oil of your choice use it to mix with the sada gum allow it to come out that and creamy consistent before you add it into your cream so right now I'm just missing as you can see look at the mixture look at the texture this is what I am going for if you want a thicker paste you can increase the sada gum if you want a less thicker paste you can either re uh, reduce the sada gum over here I have one teaspoon of my sada gum then I'm gonna pour it into my juice like so that I will go in with my hand mixer then I'm going to mix everything to to allow the sada gum to bind with the rest of the ingredient also this shampoo out here can be used of any air texture if you are relaxed if you are natural if you have that drop dreadlock for both kids and adult air you are good to go so right now I'm just missing as you can see me do So lovely, the last but not the least, I'm going to preserve my shampoo because I'm not using my immediately. I use my after three weeks, so I have to preserve it. So after I preserve, I'm going to mix once again to allow the preservative to merge with the rest of the evidence. Right now, I will go in with my applicator bottle. I'm going to transfer my shampoo into my applicator bottle like so. So lovely, yes, how you can make an effective air growth shampoo, guys, to give you a lot of sleep to moisturize your air conditions your air treats your scalp from any scalp irritation alopecia badness shady postpartum shady if you're having dandruff inchy scalp dry air and brittle air just apply this shampoo once in a week you are going to love it and because i added a uh, sada gum into the shampoo it helps in also detangling your hair it has so many amazing sleep which is good for helping our hair to feed the tangle and moisturize. So lovely, today is after three weeks, I want to shampoo my hair. I have been rocking my hair like so for the past one month plus and your girl has been loving loving it right now here is my shampoo how do i love to apply my shampoo to get all the benefits from this shampoo i urge you all focus on your scalp first because if you treat your scalp if your scalp is where take care of if your scalp is well treated your hair is going to grow without breaking so i love to firstly apply this shampoo treatment into my scalp work it through moisture and massage it really really well as you can see me do because if your scalp is well stimulated if your scalp is well clean your hair is going to grow without any form of stress so i urge you all first focus the shampoo into your scalp like so because you want to treat your scalp this shampoo out here is going to cleanse your scalp treat your scalp and also without stripping your natural oil away from your scalp which will help in promoting healthy hair growth faster and guys don't forget your airline anywhere at all you are having any hair issue any hair problem just focus the shampoo into that area guys you are going to see a dramatic result in less than a month after four application guys you will see a lot of change when it comes to your hair and guys don't forget to massage massaging your scalp is therapeutic it helps in stimulating blood flow into our scalp when blood is well floated into our scalp that's where our hair tends to grow healthy okay so always try and make sure you massage your scalp really really well when you apply this shop so after i massage now my scalp is being treated so i will go in now with the rest of my hair because it helps in condition 
moistening the air, increase your sebum, which your scalp produces, moisturizes your air, adds shine to your air, thickens, darkens the air, and promotes healthy air growth. So after you added the shampoo into your scalp, then you want to focus it now to the rest of your air and also to your air line. Don't forget the tip of your air as well. I mean, the end of your air is extremely important. Allow the shampoo to absorb, as you can see me doing, into your airline as well because you want to treat everything. If you are having a lot of split air, a lot of breakage, just try a corporate shampoo into your air regimen. And right now, I'm going to massage every part of my air to clean my air from any build up at all. So, lastly, I will still go in with my airline into a little bit of my shampoo into my airline. Then I'm going to massage my airline. I love to treat my airline for the last, but that's why I, I love to give all the TLC. Look at my eye. My eye, my eye is so red because of the onion so far, which is so, so good. So right now, I'm going to cool my hair up. Guys, this method, when you apply your shampoo, allow it to sit for at least 30 minutes to one hour before you use lukewarm water to raise it at after you raise it out, you can have condition your air, you are good to go. So I will allow my air to sit up for one hour. Yes, the after one hour, I will use lukewarm water to raise it out. The ones remaining, I will keep inside my fridge, as you can see. So lovelies, with this, we come to the end of today's video. Hope you all find it useful as always. Thank you all for watching. Like, share, subscribe is free of charge until i will see one in the next one remain blessed and you know what peace bye bye i love you all kiss kiss mwah, mwah, mwah.